Hello and welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone is having a fantastic week and in today's video we're going to be looking at something which I've been looking forward to getting my hands on for so long and it has kindly been sorted out by the awesome Bow Selectors Coins. So stay tuned and let's have a look inside this package. Okay so before we do actually have a look at what's inside we've just got to appreciate uh, the stampage. I mean this is pretty epic and of course you know it's from Bow Selectors Coins when you get profanities on the front just like this coins and snow uk which of course is my nickname on the discord voice chat because i have a tendency to fall asleep now and again uh, so i got in touch with Bo, who does live fairly close to the mint and that is a little clue um, as to what's inside but let's flip this over and i know that yeah there is okay so we have some sort of um ferris wheel and the sun shines <laughs> out and of course, I'm assuming that's me on the top saying, get me off. Now, I'm not sure if um, any of you follow me on Instagram or Facebook, but I did put a post. I just recently took my kids to um, one of the local fun fairs, And I've actually got to that point in my life where I actually got refused on board a ride. Because unfortunately, I was just too festively plump. Um, but no hard feelings. Uh, health and safety comes first so I did get off and um, I let my kids enjoy the ride but of course you've got to giggle, giggle about these little things in life and of course uh, Bow Selector is always first on the list so there we go and that's smashing yeah the stampage wow you've got a serious hoard of stamps but it gets the job done okay so let's have a little look inside because um, I've been pre-warned there is a letter inside this and I'm Bo doesn't normally do letters, so I am looking forward to reading what is put, to be fair, so uh, yeah, let's do it. Okay, so I have pre-opened this, but I've not actually had a look inside, so. Um, I, what's this? Okay, I'm assuming this could be my little special gift, which Bo has sorted out, and there's something else in here. Oh, hang on, there we go. Ah, we've got a letter. Okay, so to Mr. Snow, I don't normally write letters when I send coins, but there's always a first, so here goes. Happy hunting. Okay, let's have a little look. Hang on. There's actually nothing in this envelope. As if, as if we got to put a letter in or something. There's actually nothing in... Oh, hang on. No, that's not it. Happy hunting. Hi, Bo. Bo, you're an absolute monkey, mate. There's actually no letter in there. I was actually feeling really excited and special there for a minute. <laughs> He's not actually put anything in here. It is empty. You just put hi on the, the back of the envelope. Oh, he is a cheeky little sod. But nevertheless, I've still got some sort of handwritten letter from Bo. <laughs> oh, what's he like? Can't believe that. I was really looking forward to reading a nice letter. But never mind, I've got that and that'll do. So let's leave that up there and let's have a look at what I've been sent. So of course, I did give a little bit of a clue as to what's inside this package. Now, Bo does live pretty close to the mint. And um, fortunate for me, he is a very good friend. And um, I did say, can you get me uh, one of these um, from the mint? And of course it is the latest strike your own now um due to um, myself being so busy with work and stuff i wasn't able to make it down i'm possibly not going to be able to make it down until you know nearer the summer holidays so what i did say to bo is there any chance you can get me um one of these strike your owns and of course it was happy to oblige and it is really nice um, i have st started collecting the stamp your owns um since i started going and getting the dinosaur coins and this one is just an absolute cracker. And I really do um, appreciate Bo sorting this out for me. So before I do forget, um, if any of you aren't subscribed to Bo Selectors Coins, please head over to his channel and um, subscribe. And of course, watch as many videos as you can. He's got some really good hunts on there. And his content is really, really good. Uh, you won't be disappointed. And of course, he has got some social medias as well. So we've got Instagram. You can find him over on there. And of course, he's got Facebook as well. 
and he has got a Facebook selling group as well which um, does have some pretty good bargains on there so be sure to check that out. I will leave some links in the description box below of this video. So of course we have got the decimal day um, 50p coin and of course I struck this 50p coin. I didn't but I was, I was close as I can get to it. And uh, 15th of February 1971 is D-Day for decimal. Okay so fairly basic packaging and of course we've got the coin itself it, and it is an absolute stunner. I was happy to get my hands on this coin. Congratulations on striking your own UK coin. A reminder of this anniversary and of your visit to the Royal Mint experience. Well thank you. Thank Bo. <laughs> we are celebrating the 50th anniversary of decimalisation with this new coin. Our 50p for 50 years marking this important moment in the history of nations of the nation's coinage. Very nice. We'll just have one more look at the coin. I'm so tempted to touch it, but I'm not going in, into that territory whatsoever, so it's getting shut back up. And of course on the back you've got the obverse of the coin, and you've got some coin specifications on the back as well. And it is really nice. And again, I am really happy with this, and I do appreciate it so much, Bo, that you um, agreed to sort this out for me. It's fantastic having friends. Um, they always say it's who you know, not what you know. And uh, yeah, it's always good to be able to get your hands on sought after coins just like this. It is great to see um, the Royal Mint um, back open, and I can't wait to be able to get down there myself to strike my very own coin when COVID restrictions allow. Now it has been fantastic to see um, a lot of the other coin tubers and friends um, popping down there for visits. I totally respect your decisions on obviously keeping things quiet and going down on the uh, on your own, etc. Um, these things have got to be respected. Um, you know, times are still uncertain at the moment. You never know uh, how things are gonna go um, with things, especially based on the past couple of years. Uh, but yeah, I do respect everyone's decisions on visiting the Royal Mint and I can't wait to um, finally be able to get down there and hopefully meet up with everyone and uh, all as many people as I can to say hello. It's been way too long and I'm looking forward to having another visit to Wales. So there we go. Thank you so much both for sorting this out for me. And of course, um, like I've said before, please go and check out Bo's channel, all his social medias. He's a fantastic chap and he is a fantastic friend for sorting this out for me. It's great to... Uh, be able to get my hands on this stamp your own coin without too much fuss at all. So let's mark you down there. With that, and there we have it, I do have a new Strike Your Own Coin. Really, really cool and I'm excited to get this up on my shelves in a minute. But of course, um, if you're but of course, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please feel free to do so. And of course, if you press that notification bell, you'll always be notified when I upload new videos like this. If you did enjoy this video, please leave me a thumbs up. And of course, if you want to leave me a comment as well in the box below, that would be absolutely fantastic. I do love answering all your um, comments and questions. And it is great to hear from everyone who continues to support my channel. All that's left to say is a massive thank you for watching. Um, stay awesome, stay safe, and always remember, there's always two sides to every coin if you take the time to look. Bye for now.